O'Brien. Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about. Whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. It's making a great week, folks. Become immune to poison. Don't take anything personally. The whole world can gossip about you, and if you don't take it personally, you're immune to you are immune. Immunity to poison in the middle of hell is the gift of the second agreement. Yeah. <laughs> Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials trading down 208. NASDAQ off 34. S&P's down 19. Gold. Gold contract down $21.80. Trading out at 19.49 an ounce. We have silver down 88 cents, 23 dollars 45 cents an ounce. Light sweet crude down a buck 28. 70 dollars 50 cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. A 10 year note up eight ticks, trading 113.10. The 30 year up, up 22 at 128.01. And good old King Dollar. King Dollar right now trading up 56 ticks, 102.578. The euro is at 109. The yen's at 141. And the British pound's at 127 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877 927 6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world? In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. What do you have? Well, we had an ABC structure up in the SPY. It finished the ABC. Bomb is right to the, the number, two, which is pretty amazing. We take a look at this. You're going to see the SPY got up to this uh, 443.90. I believe that it was, a, it was about 444 something, okay? Bottom line, hit it, pull back, you know, you can see the, the volume is so light today, it's pretty amazing. So the bottom line is you don't have a lot of sellers out here. We'll see how this uh, shakes out. I expect some kind of a pullback to a consolidation. That's what I suspect we're going to have here. The NDX 100, believe it or not, <laughs> this, is, this one's a mind blower, man. Because even when I was saying it's going to go to that swing point, it's like, you got to be kidding me, man. I mean, it got there fast, too, man. I mean, you take a look at this. Bottom line, it got to the swing. The swing that we were talking about here was the 371.83. We hit 372.85. Now, what you had here is this. You hit the swing, and you closed under it. Hey, look at this one here. That's that one. That's 356, yeah. So when you do that, folks, what, what happens is this. You get to the swing. You fail on price. When you fail on price, but you have the volume, all it means is that, yeah, you're going to get a small pullback, and it's going to go right back up to the highs that were generated out here uh, on Friday. That's how this shakes out. So that 372.85 is going to get whacked again. Gold. Gold contract continues to be on an ABC structure down to 1902. We're getting there slowly but surely. It's a big ABC down. Um, Bottom line is that, uh, let me just look at this. I hope it didn't set up another ABC down. I don't think it did. Let me see this if I can. Hmm. What is that? That's, that's 264. That's 266. It did. Holy cow. Okay, hold it. Okay, so we have an ABC down in 1902 right now, but guess what? I just realized this just broke another one. So what do we have here? So this is 2075. What do we got? So you got, holy cow. Um, this one, 75. We got a bucket a quarter. That's going to get you down to 1850. What's the bottom? Yeah. It's an ABC down 1850. This broke, this broke with volume last Thursday. So now you get an ABC down to 1850. And your swing low is 1846. That's quite a setup, man. Bottom line, it is what it is. That's how that's set up. Now, if you do look at the XAU and the HUI, when I was doing the goal report this morning, take a look at these. I'll show you something. XAU. This is what you want to look for. So you're down 451 right now in the XAU. 
you can see that monster volume on Friday. On Friday, we had a, a rebalancing all over the place, folks. The volume was monster. But this gump coming over here on the, is it the 13th? I believe it's, one second, let me go to the HUI so I can see it better. We take a look at the HUI. It's right here. The strength, yeah, it's the 13th of March. So as we came off the lows, the 13th of March, that's your benchmark. Let me put this up here. And what's going to be intriguing is that it's real possible that we might get this volume today and have a, a nice ABC structure down. It, yeah, so right there, I expect the high of that is 229, the low is 213. That's where I expect we're going in the XAU, so that your benchmark there is the 13th of March. That's what you want to be keeping an eye on. We go into the note and bond market out here. Notes and bonds, they continue to want higher price, lower yield, no matter what the Fed's going to do. That's how they, this thing is set up. They've rejected lower price. Every time that they go lower, there's no sellers. Bottom line, you can, you can see the 10-year right now. You know, we made a low last week with 1.7 million contracts at 112.12. You're at 113.09. You did a deep retracement, no doubt about that, but might take your bill calls. You're going to go back up the other side once again. And then if we get into the oil contract, oil contract out here trading at a price point of 70.50. This is also in a consolidation, but a lower end, meaning that it wants to go lower and it's building costs for lower price. You can see this out here today. Uh, let me do this. Uh, I see we're rolling too. We're rolling on a monthly. This is the active contract, but we're rolling on a monthly. So what you have here that's game is 64 bucks once again. 64, five days ago you were down to 66. The 64 is game once again. So stay right there, folks. Come right back with our man, Mr. Basil Chapman. We have the Dow. The Dow Industrials right now is down 206. You get the Nasdaq off 26. S&Ps are off, off 18. We'll come right back, folks.